Hello, gentlemen. Patrick Ryan here, founder of Wingman for You. We help men find the women of their dreams by teaching them how to approach women with confidence. Now, gentlemen, this video is about sex and how it can impact a relationship. That is a romantic relationship, not just a BFF, uh, friends with benefits. Let's just move away from that a little bit for right now. This is really about sexual passions from both the men and the women in romantic relationships, and especially early on in that relationship. Now, guys, I've made videos before about sex and how we should hold off as long as possible. I don't mean a week or two weeks. I mean several months when you get involved with a lady for the first time. And the reason being is because our minds change. Our whole chemical structure of the relationships will change. It'll get excited. It'll be enthusiastic. It'll be very lustful. But that's not a good representation of a real romantic, loving relationship. Now, this is depicted very, very well in Big Bang Theory Season 2, Episode 10. Now, in this case, Leonard and Fred had their on and off thing. This is only Season 2, remember? And now Leonard is dating Dr. Stephanie. Now, Dr. Stephanie is a very sophisticated woman. She's attractive. She's really everything Leonard has ever wanted in a relationship because they're in bed all the time. So this is about a month or two into their relationship. And Penny happens to come over and talks to Leonard. And Leonard's like, oh, no, we're just keeping it casual. We're having a good time. And Penny's like, mm, no, you're not, Leonard. I think you guys are living together. And Leonard, of course, is defensive and says, no, we're not. She goes, oh, really? Come with me. So Penny walks into Leonard's bedroom, looks around, says, oh, what beautiful floral sheets you have. Oh, gosh, look at this picture of these people live at Disneyland. Who are they? Leonard's like, I don't know who they are. Oh, where's my things? Where is where's everything gone? Why is there candles at night? <laughs> Oh, it's just hysterical. So Leonard makes a decision. Gosh, we're just moving way too fast. He hadn't even noticed. He wasn't even paying attention to the changes that took place in his own bedroom. So he shows up at work. He's in the cafeteria with Rajesh and with Howard. And they're laughing at him because he's got this big blue crow on the front of this dark sweater that Stephanie gave him. And they're really going, Dude, that's ridiculous. That looks terrible. And he's like, well, Stephanie gave this to me. I need to wear it. And they're like, boy, you are whipped. She's got you tied around your finger. Come on. What are you doing here? He says, you know, things are just moving so fast. I just don't know what to do. So he gets out his phone. He starts texting Dr. Stephanie. And he tells her, I think we're moving too fast. I'd like to slow things down. Well, within a few seconds, there's a response. And Leonard's like, oh, I got to go. She's offering sex. Now, guys, here's the biz biggest dysfunction that happens in new romantic relationships is that women, in this case, Dr. Stephanie, believe that if they put out sex for the man, that they'll win his heart, that they will win love. Now, men believe that if they show a woman love, that they will get sex. And I've got to tell you guys, both of them are wrong. The reality is, is in order to fall in love with somebody, you need to get to know them. You need to get to understand them. You need to get to know their most vulnerable places in their lives. Oh, what's really deep down inside of this person? And then we need to find some empathy in that relationship. And in this case, they're not connecting on an emotional level other than sexual. And that's a lot of fun, guys. I've been there. I've done that let's just say dozens of times. And there's nothing wrong with that. If that's a relationship you're looking for, there's nothing wrong with that. But that doesn't create a long lasting, sustainable relationship. I hope you've learned something from this video. Oh, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. There's some great videos on there that will help you find the woman of your dreams. We'll see you in the next video.